Hello, I'm Dr. Sri Banerjee, epidemiologist, biostatistician, faculty member. And in this um, lecture, I'm going to be going over um, how to calculate not only crude mortality rate, but age adjusted mortality rate as well. So let's go ahead and get started here. Um, the, the, as I said, um, the first thing we're, we're going to be going over is the crude mortality rate. So right here, um, if you look at the number of deaths um, for, and this is the crude mortality rate for population A, no. um, uh, and then we have population B. Um, so 90 is the number of deaths, and then 24,000 is the population. Um, so when you're taking a look at this, um, the answer for crude mortality rate is, um, and let me um, scroll down here. Um, the crude mortality rate um, is um, three over eight, three eighths. So this is three eighths, and then um, what you're trying to do here is um, take a look at um, the proportion of each age group in population B. So when you're looking for the um, proportion of each age group in population B, what you're trying to see um, is the ratio of 15 through 19 um, right here. So for 15 through 19, you have 3,000 over 4,800. And then 20 to 24, you have 1,500 divided by 4,800, and that's the total. And then um, 25 to 29, you have 300 over 4,800. So the next question is um, stating, um, refer to the text in question six to answer the question, complete the second stage and age adjusting. Um, so now we're trying to figure out the crude mortality rate for each population A age group. Uh, and the crude mortality rate has been um, calculated. Um, now um, complete the age adjusting calculations and provide the age adjusted mortality rate for population A. Put answer in per thousand. So let's revisit this one more time. Calculating um, crude mortality rate for each population A age, um, age, age group is something that you want to um, take a look at. Um, so let's let's take a look at this here. So when when we're calculating this, um, what we want to do is go into each age group in population A um, and calculate the crude mortality rate. So remember the total we already did um, in the first um, place. And then now um, 40, you can calculate this, um, 40 over 4,000 for 15 to 19, 30 over 6,000, 20 to 24, 25 to 29 is 20 over 14,000. Um, so that's the crude mortality rate in population A. Age group. Now we're gonna. What we're gonna do is use the age group um, in population. Uh, use use some of the proportions of population B to inform population A. Um, so um, remember, we went over the crude mortality rate. So now um, uh, put answer in per one hundred thousand. Pr um, provide the age adjusted mortality rate. So let's take a um, peek at how. We're going to do this here. Um, so now at this stage, what we're going to do is um, show you um, how to do this calculation now. Um, so this is 40. So let's um, start this drawing again. Um, this is 40 uh, 
divided by 2,000, or 40 divided by 4,000. And then what we're doing here is um, also divide, so 40 divided by 4,000 uh, times, since this is 15 through 19, um, this is 3,000. Three thousand over forty-eight hundred. So, um, what is happening is you're age adjusting uh, with the calculations of population and um, and population B. Um, so, j just to draw this one more time, you have. Crude mortality rate, and then the age adjusted. You you're adjusting with population B's um, uh, ratio. So this is 15 to 19, and population B divided by uh, 4800. So uh, I hope this age adjustment makes sense. Um, sometimes this can get um, quite complicated. However, um, when you go through each um, question um, one step at a time, then you can actually um, get to the final answer um, uh, easily. Um, I hope this has made some sense. Thank you.